Construction circles are transparent modeling aids that are not shown or printed in drawings. You can place them in the model to help position and align objects around a circle. They are also needed when you create conical or cylindrical lofted plates to define the shape of the lofted plate. To start, click Construction Object and select Circle. You have three options to create a construction circle. The first option is switched on by default. Pick two points to define the center point and radius of the circle. As you can see, the circle is created on the same plane as the point you picked. Here is another example. The second option allows you to define on which plane you want to create the circle. This can be useful when you need to create vertical or tilted circles. Pick three points to define the center point, the radius, and the plane. If you are creating a vertical or tilted circle, you need to have another object on which you can pick the third point. You can use construction lines for this purpose, like in this example. The third option creates a circle out of any three points you pick, as long as they are not on the same line. The order in which you pick the points does not matter. Here is another example in 3D. Now that a construction circle has been created, you can modify it by using direct modification. For example, you can modify the radius. You can also move the entire circle. As you can see, the circle stays on the same plane. Finally, double-click the circle to see its properties. You can change the color and line type by using these two settings.